Project Lead the Way for our students is taking some relevant biology, some medicine, some forensics, and having the kids explore these things through projects. It gives us the kids an opportunity to follow the progression of someone who has different medical disorders and we figure out ways to diagnose them, we figure out what it is about them, how we treat them, and then ultimately the kids leave with a foundation of what biomedical science is. On the very first day we had the crime scene out and the students come in not knowing anything about the course yet and they come in and they actually even before they sit down, they, they, they start walking over to the, the crime scene and they're wondering like what's going on, what's happening, why, and they start pointing out some of the evidence already even before the class even really starts. Uh, and then they are, you know, they're sitting there chatting with their friends and, you know, trying to inquire what's really going on. And then from there, then we go into the whole aspect of, you know, who it is and, and so on and so forth. The students really get involved and really learn uh, how to handle science as an adult, as, as a scientist, and really enjoy it. Okay. So those are the numbers you're going to read. Oh, it's in here. Okay. The Project Lead the Way program is really uh, fit to benefit both students and the community that will receive those students who have those skills in biomedicine. St. Luke's has been partnering with, with us actually in the class. They add a, a sense of reality to the course, not that the course lacks any type of uh, engagement, it's a highly engaging curriculum, but when uh, medical students from St. Luke's come in and, and, and go into those classes and have relationships with the students, you get the career piece and you get the authenticity piece that other programs just can't match. Um, Mr. Ayer and Ms. Peters have given our medical students a lot of freedom with what they want to do when they go in the classroom. I think the idea is kind of that they should be there to help um, the high school student, students um, see the diseases that they're learning about from a little bit more of a clinical perspective. Well, my impression of the program is that it's really exciting. Um, as a scientist myself, I think it's a really cool program and something that I would have liked the ability to participate when I was in high school. This would be like 0 to 120 and this should be the 50 to 250? Correct, that works, that's perfect. Yeah. Okay. So Even before this class I definitely knew I liked the medical type field and biology sciences. But this class definitely made it more interesting because of all the hands-on labs and uh, things like that. The fact that we get to learn about something that they usually don't have classes on, like it's just typically the, you know, biology and then physics and chemistry, but to find out like stuff that they actually use in the real world, like when you know people pass away or like crimes happen, we get to see like the in-depth thing that you see kind of on TV, but you get to kind of put yourself into it and be in their shoes and figure out that stuff. The different aspects that go into it, um, how it incorporates something like appealing and like solving a mystery, so it's, it doesn't just seem like work, like you're going towards something and there's like an end goal, it was really neat to me. The class really, it opens your mind and makes you think about other careers like in the world. Like a lot of people haven't thought about what they want to do with their life when they get out of college and this class really makes you think that hey, this could be something for me. Um, to be honest, it's kind of just every lab that we do. Uh, like I said, it's very hands-on. At first, I was kind of on the fence about the class, but as we got more into it, I started really enjoying it, and I'm really glad that I took the class. Well, I've always wanted to go into the medical field when I got older, and not a lot of places really offer a course that you can actually see what careers are in the medical field for you, much less do labs that are actually there and realistic, such as when we did the um, blood typing lab, that's an actual lab that people actually do in the real world. So it's more hands-on, and it's a lot more in-depth than your normal biology class. Well, it's interesting because what I see with the kids was they would start out thinking the course is going to be one way, a typical high school class. And so they want to sit there and kind of be told this great, exciting biomedical stuff. But the course isn't designed that way. The course is designed from day one for them to really get involved. And so some students, um, honestly, some students get a little shocked by that. They, you know, they're not used to sitting in a class and, and, and doing projects, they're used to sitting there and being told stuff and write it down. So what I've seen over the, over the course is that they eventually adapt to that and then they start to do the projects and start to see that 
this way of learning is, I don't want to, I don't know about more fun, but this way of learning is, is better for them because they're not just learning facts, they're exploring and then they're engaging and, and they're doing projects and they're doing labs. So um, some kids get that right away, other kids have that little learning curve, but eventually maybe a couple, three weeks in, they realize that there's a pattern to this and they, they try and follow it.